before I joined the army, I wouldn't have ran a truck through somebody's front gate, blown their doors off their hinges, zip tied their family, and drug them out in the middle of the night. Like, I wouldn't have done that. It, it wasn't right. But you know, we go through basic training, and in eight weeks, you go from killing is bad, because you grew up in church, and thou shalt not kill, to killing is good. It's the apex of your professionalism. The, the better you are at it, the, the more you're gonna be regarded in high esteem. And in all actuality, you, you are broken. You've done things that you probably shouldn't have done, seen things that you probably shouldn't have seen, and you're gonna to try to stick it out the same way that you did when you were in the military, just by brute force and ignorance. And uh, it's not gonna work. And you're not gonna have that peer pressure around you to, to support that type of behavior. Or your family's not gonna put up with the excuses that you need to be gone on another deployment. You know, you're eventually gonna to have to come to terms with this. The way that I had damaged my character was the way that they told me I was going to be honorable. Right, I would feel better. The good guy always kills the most bad guys and gets the girl at the end. And he always is the hero at the end of the day, has the parade and gets the ribbons. But really, it's not how it works out in real life. You're going to damage yourself in a manner that nobody told you about and you're not gonna know about. And you're not even gonna realize that you're broken in that way until somebody brings it to your attention. And you need to work on it.